Hey everybody, here we are for match three. We're two and oh, trying to three and oh. We've won the die roll. We're gonna play first. We get on a surprisingly keepable hand with a fan bearer into a scavenger. Keep, keep, keep. And let's see what variety of red deck we're up against in the finals. All right, let's go planes. Fan bearer, pass the turn. We have the outside option of Kopesh Equip Fanbear, but I don't think we'll do that. Depends on what our opponent plays, of course. Opponent plays... Player Mountain. I know you've got one. Opponent plays what? A swamp, not a mountain. Absolute insanity. Ooh, compulsory rest. All right, so we will get in for one, and then we'll drop our battlefield scavenger. And then uh, we got options. We got lots of options. Black, green, counters. That's kind of bad news for us. Uh, Hazard's Monument. I don't really like that plan. Don't like it one bit. Not with any creatures left or stuff that we want to throw away. So yeah, let's go Kopesh. Let's equip the Kopesh. And let's bash in for four. You want to block and get a zombie? I'm totally okay with that. Zombie it up. Kudu. Cartouche. That's gross. Guess we're going to compulsory rest that. Hit me for three. Gain that three life back. Ooh, we're just going to try to zeal it. <laughs> that also works. And for three, we could rummage. Rummage away the monument. It seems pretty crummy now. Um, yeah, let's rummage because we're going to need some gas. Goodbye, monument. You're not doing anything for us. Land, I guess that kind of works. That lets us do multiple things. Three colors. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Neff Crop Entangler. Don't mind if I do. Um, so, let's see if our opponent desires to double block and see if we can blow them out. Blowout? No blowout. Uh, well, we're certainly dropping a Nef crop, and then the question is, are we compulsory resting the Naga? I don't think so. If he wants to exert it and draw a card, I think I'm okay with that. We'll compulsory rest whatever he draws that is probably better. And if he cartouche, cartouche, cartouches Slitherblade, then we make him very sad, and we throw another enchantment on it, one that he's not going to like very much. In for three. I will go to 14. You can draw a card. Soul Stinger. Nah, that's actually problematic. We don't want to compulsory arrest that. That is problematic. So. So. So, uh, we could tap it and get in for one, two, three, four, and then compulsory rest something else. 
four would take him to 11. Um, we could hook the Kopesh up on somebody else. Tap it. Get in for one, two, three, four, five. Take him to 10. And then next turn we have Compulsory Rest and Brute Strength. Um, yeah, I think I like that. Let's be super aggressive here. Um, yeah, so let's move this over to the Scavenger. Let's tap the Soul Stinger. Let's get in. Um, are we going to throw away any of these three cards? I don't think so. We need the Compulsory Rest for whatever he plays. We need the Deem Worthy, and we need the Brute Strength to surprise finish the game. So no, we're not going to throw anything away. Take him to 10, pass the turn. If he wants to hit us for 3 and take us to 11, I'm fine with that. We win this race, I think. Sure, down to 11. Pass of the turn, sweet. Um, so, I will come in for two, leave up fan bearer, tap something down, take him to eight. Yeah, I like that. In for two. No blocks, no surprises. No blocks, no surprises. Drop an F crop, pass the turn. Probably tap down that Watchful Naga so he doesn't draw any cards. Hey, we won. Seems like a bit of an early concede, but we won there. All right, let's get back in, do it again, and 3-0 and this. All right, we get dealt an unkeepable hand, unfortunately, so we're going to have to mulligan that and go to 6, which gives us uh, an equally unkeepable hand. So we're going to have to mull that, I believe. We're on the draw, but we have less planes than we have mountains, and we just can't do anything, so we're going to go to 5. Um, that's equally terrible. Uh, I don't super want to go to four. I think the correct thing is to go to four, but I will keep and throw that away. And we have to draw a mountain over toast. This seems like the way that I usually go out. <laughs> One drop cultivator, sure. Mountain, got there. Never didn't have it. So our opponent's what? Blue, blue blacks? I, I, they might just be full-on three colors. Um, so we could make this what? A 2-3? Which stops the double blocks. Or is Nefcrop just a better play? Um, hmm. Nefcrop uses more mana. We're going to be racing that Slither Blade, I think, for the time being, anyways. Um, Yeah, let's Cartouche. I think? Ugh, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, let's Cartouche. Start the race off on the right foot, one damage ahead. In for two. Cartouche. We're playing against a Slither Blade deck. A single piece of removal, and he's toast. 
Battlefield Scavenger. Nifty. Well, we're going to get in for three. Block, sure. Let's drop an F crop entangler. Pass the turn. <clears throat> in for two, you got it. Find Great Maw, gross. Alright. Oh, that's problematic. Mountain. Well, we'll drop it. Then we'll drop Battlefield Scavenger. And then I think we just lose, because we can't get through a 4 5, right? Attack with Flame Blade, Adept, it dies. Attack with Nefcrop Entangler, it dies. Pass the turn. We could drop True Heart Twins next turn. If we hit a land, we can double exert, give everything plus two, plus O. Oh. So this would be five. Well, we're close. We're close to attacking in. Brute Strength. All Well, Brute Strength kind of does it here. It allows both that and that to get us through. I mean, the odds of him having a green combat trick feels pretty high. But let's make him have it at least. Uh, we are not going to discard anything. Yeah, double block the flame blade adept. You bet that's what I want. We're not even going to lose a creature here. Five damage, first strike. Kill your great maw. Sack your cultivator, sure. It wasn't going to die, but sack it. Kill your great maw, get in for three. Whew. Doom to center, sure. Hit me for two. I'm going to hit you for a lot more. A second creature? Dromedary. All right. Well, now I'm going to hit you for a little bit less, I guess. Um, no plays, or no attacks, unfortunately. So we're just going to have to drop the hyena pack. Pass the turn. Oh, that True Heart Twins is still going to be huge if we hit it. We'd attack in for what? 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. We'd attack in for 22, which seems good. But if our opponent keeps establishing their board, we just ain't quite going to get there. Welp, do we go all out on it? We have one blocker left. And he's going to come in for ten, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we die on the crack back if he doesn't block, but he dies if he doesn't block. If he blocks, say, there, and blocks there. Well, no, that dies to everything. Yeah, I think we just do it. I mean, he may have a, a, a card in hand that really screws us over, but I think this is kind of our, our best shot. Attack, attack, exert, attack, exert, attack, attack. Exert triggers! In for 22 by my count. 10, 20. Oh no, sorry, 27. Oh no, sorry, that doesn't count. 21. In for 21. Block there, they trade. Block there, that dies, and he takes 4, 8, 9, 10, 11. He's going to go to 2? He's 
gonna go to two and he's gonna have a zombie and a slither blade slither blade on board. Ooh, trick. Destined. Give it indestructible. Okay. So it's four, five, six, seven, eight. We're not dead. We're not dead. And we're gonna have three attackers and he's gonna have two blockers. And we've got menace. I don't think our opponent can attack here. Oh no! Oh, that is the worst. That's the worst. That's the worst. Goodbye, Nefcrop. You weren't attacking next turn anyways. So opponent's going to go up to five. Oh, goddamn. <laughs> Does our opponent have one frigging Slither Blade? I'm disappointed that people are totally going to take away from this. This is a real deck. We draw a fan bearer. Um, well, we're not dead next turn. We're close. So if we come in with team, our opponent goes block, block, take three, and go to two. Um, this would trade with one of these. This would just straight up die. I guess we drop the fan bearer and pass the turn. Oh, that lifelink changed everything. Absolutely everything. In for three in the air. I will take it. Bitterblade, sure. Ret crop. Um, can we do anything here? We could tap down that. Attack with team. Block. Block. Take our opponent down. No, I think we just played the ret crop. Play it safe. Opponent's out of cards. We can tap down the slither blade. We're okay for the time being. Tap down the slither blade. Tap, tap, tap. In, in. In, in, exert. Well, I have to choose to not die, so I will block stuff. I will go block and block. And I could go to one. That seems bad. Oh, we got first strike. Yeah, we got first strike. We're good. We are good. What you got, opponent? A watchful Naga. Sure. Mountain. That's gross. Uh, so, opponent is going to attack with that watchful Naga next turn, just to draw a card. And we get to just eat it. Uh, so we'll pass the turn here. We will tap down that Slither Blade. How desperate are you, opponent? You are desperate. Draw your card. Lose your Naga. Hoodie Bee. Ah, that's a problem. Three twos should not become five fours. That is so many levels of BS. Um, so we're not blocking. Well, we're not blocking with Flame Blade. We're gonna have to block with the Warrior. So we get in for two. Yeah, I feel like this card definitely said plus one plus one, and then it was one of their we should make the format faster changes. Block. Hey, hey, our opponent didn't draw gas. Neither did we. Um, so we'll pass the turn. And then we're going to have to lose our flame blade adept.
This card also was probably a 4-3 for 4 mana, not a 5-4 haste for 4 mana. Um, are we dead? We're just dead, right? We could tap the crocodile, block the hooded brawler, go to 2. But our opponent's going to go up to 8, so we're dead. This is just uh, all academic. And exert. Block to not die. And give me that last land so that I can rage quit. Yeah! Concede. <laughs> uh, trial of zeal, of course. All right. Um, let's not die like that is the plan. Blazing Volley doesn't hit anything. Um, Forsake the Worldly could get rid of a cartouche, but that feels kind of dumb. Uh, I don't think we want to... I mean, the Monument's not doing anything great for us, but there's nothing that we really want to come in. So let's just go for it, and let's uh, draw better. Let's not draw nine lands. Play first. Let's also not mold a four or whatever it was. Well, that's keepable. We've got a pair of Nef Crops and a Brute Strength, and then one land gets us a, uh, a Ret Crop, so we'll keep. We got both colors. The only thing that could be better is if we had a one drop. Boop, and go. Flame Blade Adept, where were you last turn? Down goes Nefcrop past the turn. We will exert this in. But boy, if he curves out into like that and then Hoodie B, we're dead. In for three. How about that? Another one. Don't play Hooded Brawler. In for two, gain a life. Um, you got it. Not walking into a lead or destined or whatever it is. Could it be? <laughs> All right. Maybe I should have played Blazing Volley. Sacred Cat. In for three. Kitty Cat, and a Flame Blade Adept. In, in, eh? Um, well... We could make him have the Destined. But then we lose both our creatures. And let's make him have the destined. Show me. There it is. And more creatures. In for three. Drop a cat. At least we get to like gain four life this turn if we brute strength the cat. And like surprise kill this exemplar. Man, opponent just curved. Well, they didn't even curve out. They just had nothing but gas in hand. All right, so we take five, we gain four, so we take one, we go to 15. Oh, <sighs> yeah. Can't beat the nut draw. Can't beat the nut draw. Pass the turn. Now well, we can kill the hippo. Dead Hippo, Dead Entangler. Come on, more gas. Play more gas. 
Yeah, there you go. Yeah, play more. <laughs> uh, cat, down you go. Pass the turn. What do we do? What do we do? Do we kill this off? Do we kill, like, that off? No, we just have no way of dealing with a 4 4, so we need to kill that off. Oh my god, more stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, all right, Battlefield Scavenger, Sacred Cat, back at it again. Why couldn't I have a Sweltering Suns or something? Uh, block and block. I will take two, gain one, take one total. Hey, our opponent didn't play anything. Got him. Um, so if we kill like the Watchful Naga, we take five. That seems terrible. We're going to do it, but it seems terrible. Boop. And what do we draw? We draw planes. All right. Or no, we're going to take four, go to two. Opponent's going to draw a card. So wait, are they splashing for Slitherblade? Slitherblade, Cartoose of Knowledge. Yeesh. All right, uh, we're dead. We can play... No, we're dead. We're dead. That's unfortunate. That's a really crappy way to go out. Losing to the utter nut draw. But hey, we 2 and out. We got to the finals. Um, I don't feel great about winning with this deck because this deck exemplifies what I think is horrible about this format. Uh, we're not going to hit, hit with that crocodile. We're going to quit. Uh, yeah, that's uh, Almond Cat. That's Almond Cat in a nutshell. Play one drops, play two drops, or get extraordinarily lucky with your draws and opens. Uh, but yeah, you guys know that. Uh, if you want to yell at me because I don't like this format, come at me. I don't care. I don't like this format. I don't think it's great. Many, 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 many people agree with me. Uh, yeah, as always, if you enjoy the videos, click that thumbs up button. Click subscribe if you want to see more. You can always find me at uh, Twitter. Uh, at the Mana League, that's L E E K, like the vegetable, not the card. You can find me at facebook.com slash the Mana League, twitch.tv slash the Mana League, where I'm starting to stream more, including non magic stuff, and uh, patreon.com slash the Mana League. Check me out there, and yeah, if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, let me know. Otherwise, see you all next time.